Bill Muncy, simply the greatest driver that ever lived. Bill Muncy, the most successful driver ever to pull on a helmet. 30 seasons, over 60 victories, six national championships. Bill Muncy, dead at age 53. Bill Muncy, always in the heat of battle, be it on the course or off, and never one to hold back. Bernie has a little problem that way. You know, he's been trying to buy class. In our society, you can't buy class, but you can not buy fast, and that's what Bernie's been able to buy. Bill Muncy, the competitor, but also the guy with heart. When anybody had a problem, he was there. Chuck Hickling needed a driver for first day qualifying money. Enter Bill Muncy. When Evelyn Manchester lost her husband Rex in 1966, the first one to console her was Bill Muncy. He sat with her all day, lending his support. He was, despite all obstacles, the true champion in a sport where your life is on the line around every turn. Why would he, like many of his fellow drivers, keep coming back? The men that, have, that I have known over the last 25 years of racing are definitely different types individuals they they have to have a challenge if they were not on race boats they'd be in race cars or climbing mountains they just have to do it and it doesn't make any difference how much we talk to them and cry and scream and holler and stay here they go out they just love it the challenge is there and they've got to try Dave Herensberger of the Pay Impact went head to head with Muncie over the years he recalls him this way he, to me, he's bigger than Babe Ruth was to baseball. Bill was Mr. Hydroplaning, and there isn't anybody that's second, third, fourth. Uh, there isn't much to talk about. He was a, a wonderful person. He was uh, a good friend of mine. Um, the biggest thing is he loved to race, and he loved hydroplane, and, which I do too, but I, I've not contributed anything like Bill Muncy has, and all I can say is for myself and, and for all our friends in the sport that, that we're just going to, there's no replacing him. We're just going to miss him, miss him a lot. Funeral services will be held in San Diego. He died, ironically, after taking the lead.